Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Accessible Computing YouTube channel, Accessible Computing Access to Technology with Accessibility. Hi, this is your tech assistant Ratul and in this video, I'm going to teach you how you can add transition effects to your PowerPoint slides. We have already made few videos on PowerPoint. If you haven't watched those videos, just visit our playlist which is available in the video description or you can find the same from our channel playlist section do like share subscribe for more videos and if you have a comments or queries feel free to ask into the comment section if you want to join our community you can like us on facebook and join our telegram channel to get latest applications or any other tech news what is transition effect transition effect is a visual effect which improves the quality of your presentation it helps to give a beautiful look of your presentation in this video we are going to learn how to do that by using screen reader for this i am using microsoft powerpoint 365 and i am using screen reader jaws because most of the thing is not so much accessible with nvda this is why I am always recommending you to use JAWS with Microsoft PowerPoint. We have already made a presentation where we have some slides. I am going to slide wise. Page up, page down, page up, to select an object, press tab, computer literacy expert slide. This is the first slide. One to four. And then page down, to select an object, press tab, logo slide, two or four. The second object, slide. Page up, to select an object. So we are in first slide. So here we just need to add a transition effect. How to add? For this, we need to go to Transition tab. Go to Ribbon tab by pressing Alt. Upper ribbon expanded. Press tab. tab to press right arrow to change the tab. Press F6 to access. Leaving menus. Draw tab. Four of insert tab. Draw tab. Design tab. Transitions tab. Six so of transitions 12, tab. Followed by K. Now I'm pressing tab. Leaving menus. Record button. Tab. Notch, comments button. Notch, menu. Tab. Share sub menu. Share this. Upper ribbon transitions preview button unavailable. Alt followed tab. by K. Sub menu transition effects button collapsed. Alt followed by K T. So transition effects button collapsed. You need to expand this button by pressing Enter key. Enter none button selected. The slide doesn't have a transition effect. One of forty nine. So screen reader gives you the proper description. Don't worry. So now no transition effects are selected. Remember those transition effects are not accessible. I mean, we can't see the effect or we can't understand, but it will give a beautiful visual look. If you are a person with low vision, then you can easily understand. Now let me press tab. You can also use up and down arrow key to choose the fall transition over button, effects. The, pre fall over button. the previous slide falls over, revealing the current slide. 14 to 49. Okay, so the this is a small demonstration air. or small description which is provided by your screen reader. So Microsoft really improves the portion of accessibility, especially for screen reader. Glitter button. The previous slide Glitter. disappears under a rolling wave of small black and white shapes, revealing the okay. current slide. And button. The previous slide glides away while the current slide glides. Morph button. Move. Drape button. The previous vortex button. So I'm the just in curtain. Slide, Ferris wheel button. The previous slide fade button. The previous curtains button. The previous slide parts in the center and then each side curtain. fold back like stage curtains, revealing the current slide. 16 to 49. So if the I press enter, button. then the applications, I mean the transition effects, Will be applied. So I'm pressing enter. Enter computer literacy expert slide. Add notes one to four. To select an object, press tab. Now the curtains, curtains of uh, presentation. I mean curtain transition effect now added. Now you, I can give the time. I mean this is a transition effect. Effect transition effect means the effect will be visible between two slides. What is the time duration? I mean how much time? Uh, what is the, wh how long I want to see the transition effect or I want to put the transition effect that I need to choose right now for this go to design tab Upper ribbon, expand, transition sorry transition tab, tab then press tab 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 leaving comment men upper ribbon sub menu tra menu transition to the slide group effect options unavailable sub menu timing sound com 
Submenu Transition Effects Button Collapse. So transition Effects. Okay, so transition effects. Now I'm pressing tab. Menu transition to this transition slide. Transition to this slide. Options on available sub menu. Change so the variation of the selected transition. Variations let you change properties of a transition effect, such as its direction. Alt followed by K O. Okay, so this is some uh, changes you can do, but it is not necessary for us. Then I'm pressing tab. Timing sound combo box. No sound. So you can give sound also. There are a lot of sounds available. I will show you a little bit uh, later. Duration edit 06.00. So this is the duration 06.00. I mean, the transition uh, will be affected till six seconds. It will take six seconds to affect it. But I don't want because I am I'm just editing. Six zero six period six. Home one zero one period zero zero space. I just want zero two seconds period. or three seconds. I am just one choosing three, three seconds. Zero three, zero three zero dot zero zero. zero, zero. zero. So I'm pressing tab. Menus, computer literacy expert slide, has notes, one to four. Okay, I hope uh, it's done. Now I'm pressing F5 to start the slideshow. F5, computer literacy expert dot PPTX PowerPoint. Compu if you can slide. see my screen, then you can able to see the transition effect. But the transition effect is now applied. Now, similarly, escape, escape. I can add another effect into page our down. This second course is designed by accessible page slide. Down. Computer literacy expert slide has notes. Wonderful page down. Computer literacy expert slide has notes. Wonderful escape, 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 escape. So sometimes what happened? There is a problem. Uh, once you have done with your transition effect, you need to save the documents, and then only you will able to run the slide, run the slideshow. Why? Because sometimes you may have some problems. If I press page down, see page up, computer literacy expert the same slide. slide. Page down, page computer down. literacy expert slide. Has notes one to four. Okay, it's the same. This course is designed by this course. Escape, escape, escape. Page down, computer literacy expert slide. Has notes. F6. Otherwise, slide I can press uh, tab. Computer um, shift F6. Notes pane. Ed, ed, shift F6. Upper ribbon. Ed, shift F6. Leaving menus. Toolbar. Okay. Spell check. No press shift F6. Slide area. Computer literacy expert slide. Has notes. Page down to select an object. Press tab. Logo slide. Two so the logo object slide. Has a lo so here I can also give another transition effect. So let me give uh, another ribbon. transition effect. Animation tab. Transition. Leave comp. Upper right sub menu menu transition to the so slide group. effect options unavailable salt enter none button select follow glitter button pan button glitter fall over button the preview glit pan button morph button drape button so vortex button the creep ferris wheel button fade button the cur fade button the previous slide fades away revealing the current slide 3 of 49 okay so I'm just using this one slot again I'm giving a upper time up duration at apply Duration edit zero zero sound combo box. Duration edit zero zero point seven zero. Oh, all home zero period. Okay, so by default I, I keep it as as it is. Now I'm playing the slideshow again. F five computer literacy expert. First slide power. curtain opens. So when I press space bar, then slide second slide. second slide will come. To fit out. Slide two logo. And the Heading second level slide logo, logo. there. Okay, so in second slide I have logo. Now I'm pressing uh, escape computer literacy escape escape. Key. escape. Page up, computer litter. Now I want to add uh, transition sounds. So how to add transition sound means when you change the slide, then you will get a sound. How to do that? Very simple. Just go to design uh, uh, transition tab. Upper ribbon. Expanded. I'm in the transition, transition tab. tab. Now pressing tab, tab, tab. Me comment menu. Upper ribbon sub menu menu transition to the slide group effect up. Timing sound combo so sound. No sound. Now enter. here I am just giving a sound. Stop previous sound button. Two of applause button. Three of twenty. Stop no sound button. Select loop until next sound. To move upper ribbon sound list box. Other sound dot dot wind Other button. Other sound wind. Button, voltage button. Push typewriter. Voltage button, typewriter. Button, push button. Laser hammer button. So I'm just giving button, a drum roll, coin button. Click button. Chime button. Cash register. Chime. chime. Button, nine of twenty. I'm enter just chime. menus. Computer literacy expert slide. Has note. Okay. So I've just chime and in the second slide, down, logo slide. Let me choose another uh, sound. Upper, comment, men, upper sub men, menu transition to the slide. Timing sound combo box. So no sound. Alt followed by K U. Enter list box. Sound I'm list box. Choosing no sound. another sound. Uh, like uh, for example, I'm choosing coin. Loop coin. Upper wind button. Push button. Laser hammer button. Explode drum roll. Bu coin button. Eleven of twenty two. I'm choosing coin. So I'm pressing. Click button, chime button, nine, I can also click button, like click button I can choose also. Shot cash register button, eight of cash register, camera button, seven of camera three button, six of palm button, five of arrow button, four arrow. of twenty, applause button, three of twenty arrow button. So I'm choosing arrow. 
Enter. Leaving Let's menus. See. Logo slide. Two. Okay. Page up. Go. So now I'm going to play the slideshow. I'm starting playing the slideshow. Listen carefully because now you can able to listen the sound which I have selected. Let's see. The sounds are applicable or not. The sounds are applied or not. So I'm pressing a five. F five. This is the sound of chime. Slide so slide. we have set the sound chimes for first slide. So if I now press space bar, let's see. This is the second slide. slide. Logo. Heading level one logo. Logo of accessible computing image. So you can add your custom sounds also. Just go to the transition tab, then press tab, tab, tab. You'll find the sound combo box where you will find an option. The last option is other sounds dot 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 where you can able to give any sounds whatever you want but remember the sounds must be just one second two second three seconds otherwise it will play mm, play again and again so this is the way escape, you can escape. just uh, create uh, slides with sounds and transition effects i hope this video helps you a lot especially if you are going to create a new presentation then definitely it will help you I can assure you so if you like this type of videos don't forget to press the like button and share your valuable opinion into the comment section whatever you have whatever you want to ask you can ask into the comment section whatever you have in your mind you can say as into the comment section this is for today see you in the next video till then stay safe take care thank you for watching this video bye bye